Alright guys, we back with some Tumba Jamas Minuteman Scout Armor in Fallout 4. Now this mod was created with the new um, Fallout 4 update, so it may not work with the older versions. I'm still on the older version. I'm on the version right before the next gen update because, you know, I was fine with the way my game looked. And as far as I know, performance hasn't really been increased in the downtown area with the new update. So, uh, he's says it right here that this mod was created with the newest creation kit and may not be compatible with older versions of the game to use all features update your game to the latest next gen patch no <laughs> for older game versions a compatibility mod is available here um i tried clicking on that link it didn't work so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna download this and i'm just basically gonna test and see if it works on the pre next gen update version and you know we're just gonna test it out together all right all right so here we are on our mo2 we're gonna install this minutemen scout and it doesn't have any ba2s which i like and some pajamas armor mods are usually really small in size yeah it's only eight megabytes which is uh, i love his mods for that you know i don't need these freaking 4k 8k stuff i don't need to see every single freaking piece of lint on the freaking fabric of the damn armor like i'm gonna be that butt cheek close to the damn thing all right so we're gonna turn this on and let's see i want to see because this is important i want to see if it's it is How, I, can, I have no complaints csl flagged all right so let's drag this up good 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 drag it right there all right so let's jump in game um this one is not going to be added to your inventory automatically like some of the other mods that he recently just added but i'm just going to use a file explorer to get it all right, so here we are in game um first thing i'm gonna do is which we'll, we'll try to fire off a, a flare see if we could get some of these minutemen scouts to appear it's probably not going to work because I just installed it. You probably got to give it like a few days for it to work, but we'll see. All right, so I think I'm s some Minutemen over there. All right, that's what I thought. I didn't think they'd be wearing it. All right, so what I'm going to do, because the plugin is ESL flagged, I can't just type it in. I mean, I can't just look up the plugin. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to type in scout and see if it pops up. We'll just scroll down. I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Huh. Do. Uh. <laughs> Minutemen Scout outfit. Okay, it's it, it's all one piece. Let me make sure. Check the headwear. Okay. Double check. All right, let me just get two just in case. All right, so yeah, it appears to be two. I mean, just one piece. But I'm gonna take two because I'll throw the other one on one Heather to see how it looks on females. So, so I could not find that freaking helmet. <laughs> I tried looking on the page. Other people were saying they was having the same problem that they could not find the headpiece. They was also mentioning some conflicts as well. I did not see any conflicts. However, um, yeah, I just can't find the headpiece in the file explorer, especially because the uh, the ESP is marked as ESL flagged. Which means I can't directly click on the plugin. I'll have to type in the name of the armor piece and hope it shows up. But only the armor showed up, not the headgear. Um, I I think it looks nice. It doesn't really appeal to me to wear it on my own character personally because I use the atomic muscle mod and it makes my character buff. And when I put this armor on, it makes him really skinny. The thing that I really like about this, like I said earlier, is that the textures are really small, and that's most likely because it looks like it's using textures and assets that's already present within the game so it just looks like it fits right in perfectly naturally one thing that i will 
critique on a little bit is this little green piece right here on the side i don't know what the heck that is that just looks a little weird for me and even the textures itself like i said i don't always look for high quality textures but this one looks a little too low even for like vanilla fallout but everything else looks really good it kind of reminds me of a hybrid of like preston garvey's armor mixed with uh mccready's it looks like a hybrid of the two so um yeah, I think it's alright. I think it's really nice. Um, assuming it doesn't have any conflicts, I'm going to keep this one. I think it would be really nice to see the, the Minutemen show up with this armor. Especially if they have that gas mask and hat. Which, I'm not going to lie, it was the most exciting thing about this mod was the headpiece. And sadly, I could not find it. I'm also going to say that these boots look really nice too. I love the bullet straps with the pouches on the both the left and right. We have like a holstered ammo clip right here on the right boot with the straps like that that looks really nice and the boots itself i really like them you know how it has that little armored plating going over it like that that looks really nice it gives you that old school like you know that Minutemen feel how they have the revolutionary soldier type of look so this is really nice all right so the next one we're going to be trying out is a pretty special one it's a very unique one um, this is the Requiem Ponies race. Uh, I have never tried it. Uh, I want to try it. Uh, it looks pretty humorous. <laughs> I wonder if the faces are animated. I was hoping... Oh, there actually is a video on it. Alright, nice. So, uh... Oh, it's age-restricted. What the heck? Did you put the ponies in bikinis? Um, uh, anyway, so... <laughs> we're gonna check this out. And the reason why I feel like... You know, I will check this out, even though it's kind of ridiculous and not really the type of mod that I'll use. It's because I don't think it has any requirements. So let's quickly read over the description real quick. Requiem Ponies is a new custom pony mod designed with more quality in mind. A lot of issues that plagued the original Crimes Against Nature pony mod has been addressed for the most part. This is still a very early release. Issues can and will arise over time. There is a patch for the Zex extended skeleton to be used with this mod as well which also has some screen archer menu support as well there is an okay amount of mains and tails for this mod starting out i will be adding more as time goes along existing can hair models should work on this but just da 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 okay yes there's a next generation thing going on i do not know about this i'm not sure what's happening this way i'm just making sure that we require the next generation above i'm just looking for the next generation above Make sure you use all false extender to use hair colors before using AWK CR if possible. There's a bug that gets rid of the hair colors. Proceed as your own risk. All right. So, no requirements. Let's download this. All right. Oh, shit. War never changes. You're going to knock him dead at the veterans hall. Tonight, <laughs> you think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. right. Oh my goodness. They're animated. <laughs> this is too cool. All right, let me see if I can make them buff. Oh yeah, baby, I'm a steed. That's right, baby. I'm kind of scared to change the presets. I don't want it to crash. Let me do it. Hey. Oh, look at this one. He's a pretty boy. <laughs> Wait, I got the girl face even though I'm a guy? Oh, this is hilarious. I want to take this guy. I want to see if I can change his hair color. Oh. Oh. Oh, I can. Hey. Oh, this is too cool. All right. Well, hello, handsome. Hello. Oh, I got wings. Wings. All right, let's go. Oh, my goodness. That's a. Uh... See, I'm not really one of those pony type of people, you know, brawnies or whatever they call them. I'm not that type of person, but I could learn to appreciate some good rigging and animation and modding. I think that the wings is really nice. 
and the anim they're so animated you know usually when you see mods like this they just throw a head on it and they don't care they don't rig the face or anything but this guy his eyes is moving around he's blinking and stuff look at that it's a handsome boy <coughs> oh i should have picked the vanilla star so i could see how the baby look oh he's still a normal baby Two horses make a human baby. Bruh. Almost. All right, everything seems to be working. Why would Voltaire do this? Uh, let me get my stats since the- Alright. Down at Concord. Let me see if these raiders are ponies as well. That would be so cool. Watch me end up doing a full playthrough with this mod just because. Because it's different. Oh, they're not ponies. Damn, that's a lot of enemies. Oh my goodness. Just don't throw any Molotovs. Shit, they throwing them. Oh, they throwing them. Shit, shit. Oh my goodness. I got the more enemies mod on. So like, enemies are at least three times the amount. And it could be up to five times the amount. You missed. You missed. I'm a horse with a gun. Is that? Is he putting his arm around the? Oh my! I'm about to. I'm about to die. Holy shit! Mm-hmm. Anyone else want it with the pony man? Oh shit. Oh, oh. It's the freaking Molotovs, man. Yo, my game crashed after I died, then it tried to reload because probably I didn't save my game after the MCM settings recorder thingy. You should do a hard save. And I did it, so my game blew up, and it was totally my fault. And I'm not jumping back in to try it again. But I am going to provide the links in the description below. If you're still here, thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I will see you guys next time.